Hey, ma yana mwenye nasi biu na yenshe entwaso. One of the stories I and you follow up on for those of you who are more very active on social media, you would realize that uh, uh, broadcaster and entertainment personality Kwesiche uh, Dakwa maybe not from the KKD appear on GTV breakfast show I think Enra now as part of the discussions you know, the issues of the economy ever up and obviously economy but up there the finance minister's name will come up ain't he Kwesiche Dakwa had cause to complain quite vehemently uh, on the finance minister and a new media akoso under his watch. Yanko and Konkoti, what he said. I read a report yesterday that broke my heart. I saw how much Ghana owes, but I also found. The Minister of Finance's company or former company gets richer. Mm -hmm. Is this what we want to continue in this country? Do we want to re elect people into office, give them their pay and their perks, and then allow them and their friends and their companies or their former companies to be the very beneficiaries of the woes of our country? This is not only about the Minister of Finance. This is about Parliament. Parliament, you must be ashamed of yourself. You have failed the people of Ghana. Because I don't think from the time of Nkrumah to date, whoever is the Minister of Finance should be benefiting every time our country goes to borrow money. Is that what happened under everybody in this country? What precedent are we setting? Yesterday when I read the report, I was so broken. And I was like, do people know this? So I called four different people, some in civil society, some in government, some in the former government. And I said, oh, but this is general knowledge. And I'm like, it's general knowledge and parliament thinks it's okay. So whoever wins the next election will also set up their own companies and be the transaction advisors when we go and take a loan. What is wrong with us as a people? So the person's motive for even going for a loan for me now is not clear because every time we take a loan, their company makes money. Does this make sense to us as a people? Look, we have leaders of industry, some who have been, you know, deprived of their finances. And in the meantime, the people who are sitting in power are stealing us blind. And all people can tell me is, oh, but this is general knowledge. What a shame. What a damn shame. When they are out of power, will they want whoever comes into power to repeat what they are doing? This is not NDC MPP. Parliamentarians, you are Asimba supposed to help FM, us protect the public purse. You can't just go and sit there and vote, I am MPP, I am NDC. Vote your conscience you and, vote, and vote your constituency. What are you expecting the MPs to do? The MPs? Mm -hmm. But you cannot become the transaction advisor for going to take loans when you are the Minister of Finance. How is that possible? They are the legislators. If they won't speak up about it for the whole country. To, but for me taking time to read this, this much over the weekend and yesterday, I wouldn't know the details of this. Well, this so yes. now go and bring all the loans we have taken and show us all the transaction advices and see whether they have links to the presidency or the people who are the ministers or the people who are in legislature. Why are we doing this to ourselves? What kind of nonsense is that? Hey! If there's a conf uh, conflict of interest. Conflict issues, of interest is uh, where it starts. So, so Shrike should be on the ball on this one. And where are they? Where are they? Look, right now, Ghana has become each one for himself, God for us all. I was speaking to one of my staff yesterday. He said, Boss, I went to buy gas. 14 kilo cylinder now is 152 Ghana cities. 150 Ghana cities to fill the cylinder, two Ghana cities for the rubber. When I take 152 Ghana cities out of my 1,400, how much is left? Now water is going up, electricity is going up, 
And some people who we have put into positions of authority are raping the country. Why? Why? You are leaving it for your children, and your children know you are doing this, and your children will come and tell other people's children that, Mo papa, mo bra. because you were stealing from the people. So those people whose parents did not steal from the people will be suffering. And your foolish children will come and tell those children, Mo papa, mo bra. Baby, what mo papa in Yesika? Asempa FM. What is this? 94.7. And nobody wants to talk about it. Because if you talk about it, they will, they will impoverish you. Hey, Masa. Obi and Kumwa. Wow, Obi. If nobody kills you, you will die your own natural death. You know. Asempa FM 94.7. So that's the, the voice of uh, Kwesite Dakwa, KKD, and uh, Mote, you know, on that uh, program on GTV. Uh, that's the GTV breakfast show. And our audience and seminar, Etuja. And it will, will, be, will be getting reactions to this because he, he accuses Parliament uh, of Neomabia Parliament, Aya. Uh, and Shada Ankui, because he thinks that uh, Parliament watchdog rule on the on the executive. Now, so my derelict Kakra in in their in their responsibility. It is something a yebeshena yetumi akum. Plus, uh, we'll get to speak to some finance people and see uh, whether because of that seeming conflict of interest uh, issue, I will raise you know. Uh, yeah, Enough for the finance minister to resign, and I said it is saying. And those are all conversations that you bit me. I have into motion and so and far. Am I in eco see saying higher sempa 94.7 FM and sana no mamma for we in trim say of house depot of house depot say and they say open durable American home care product. At affordable prices, sir. Oko Ofusus House Depot, Ubenyabi. Na a range of products near plumbing materials, kitchenware, lighting, building materials, etc. And then, you know, you were, yes, I do bridals in the same building as Ofusus House Depot. Na a honing soap, bridal gowns, open shoes, open ropes, bouquet, and other bridal accessories. Ubenyabi at all. A woho intimation and so am I in. Yeah, we are refer a brief highway, high tension sawmill. Wa and ah, yeah, we ubit me a friend and as was in the WhatsApp. And they are called zero five nine one four seven one six two one zero five nine one four seven one six two one. Ofosus House Depot, your one stop shop for all your American home care product. Munsha nso, am I in? And ah, oye Tyler, oye. House owner, or your project manager, say, Uber to tiles, I'm our client, and yeah, Jehoa. Oh, here, tile adhesives, papa. Tile adhesives, papa. Ain't it? Yeah, what the JB Forge Profix tile and marble adhesives. I come for a day amount. I'll tell you more about that. My name is Honorable Richard Achampon, young inning comma, or a member of the Finance Committee, MP for Bia East constituency. Honorable Akwa, but it's saying. Boko, Minia. Obiniana. Obini, a constituency Boko. Yeah, Mr. Yamia Dom, Yamia Dom, Bibia, Bibia Boko. And a Yefrewa, and yet, and yet, Bonnie. There's been this conversation around. Finance minister and a conflict of interest position or uh, womb uh, because company uh, either say or your owner and as a former owner and our shareholder a uh, womb uh, seems to benefit from bonds any idea you floaty uh, on the capital market and maybe I can say because of that in Tinebi also in the Juma at all the latest to join that call a uh, broadcaster. Kwesi Chei Dakwa and Wakasa in very, very, very angry tone said Parliament in Sono as a mon shadam wow me. Womuna matina wa shen shahima sadi e cause you serve on the finance committee. Mona muo 
oversight responsibility on the Ministry of Finance. At all saying, Oh, be my man, now I can make sure what you for. I'm sir, Matthew, you know, because he said that one. Minimum said, No, you're here now because I'm sharing the dress, you know. He appeared to be one of the era chief or salt chief. No, you so your honey. I be an choice of way for the day, no, no. Okay. And see, in three interview, no. Now, he ended up dreaming parliament. My sister will come and know it today, but I'm not going to say the kind of policies we do in this country, no. And he said, Did you know what would have expected to the minority, you know? And they did do the crusade. Mm-hmm. So they are a month of going to win and a cost of none among the two. But what did me tell you? I was uh, I was really shocked by his conclusions. I said so because more than four years in India, started cancer as a minority. We have raised this issue severally. And it's a bit of a catch, I mean, I know, an artist has them where. We don't say now, on follow conversations, we don't say, I'm not saying, 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 I'm Black time line as part of the uh, 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 transactional advising. Oh, I'm also no belong to Honorable Dubois. So what is each way thing? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah raising oh, on the floor of parliament on committee level temporary. I'm a media guy here because the culture is here. Finance minister, no, a data banker. Yeah, because of me, the leader ranges and transactional advisors, you know. Before I saw by a finance minister, no. What we show to crime a tip So I resign from data bank. And if he doesn't take salary as a finance minister, mm-hmm. so Kaya is on playback on your own show. The finance minister for Nyaket here. And look at the mouth for Kate. Now, so when you're here, now the mouth for cinema and queries are there. What is your motivation? Other school of thought also have it said. Bills are all cut. The company benefit to Onya no. Onya ke kwa kwa is enough for you because every transaction be here is zero point one zero point five or one percent kwa kwa What do you need a government salary for? You don't need it. Only this year, on the floor of the house, on our terrace, the winning and before car queen off. But besides this question, sir, all these companies now are more relation with the finance minister and the other people who are closer to government, you know. Or more big companies, you know, how much have they benefited from all the euro bonds raised? This question was asked in parliament. The finance minister himself was there to answer this question. Honorable Suhini, MP for Tamil and North, it a similar question. On the floor, in respect of all these issues, and see, in a public knowledge, minority is raised temporarily, but nobody is supporting us. We have national security, we have Yoko, we have Shrag, and nobody is picking up this matter. So, why do somebody turn around to bring parliament on this subject matter? Finance committee is raised it. It has been part of our debate. Almost every transaction about four be I know we raise it. All of us and you need to be To the extent that non committee members have seen issues raised by the finance committee members, the five questions and the minister has come before the house to answer those questions. And see, why in the big massage minority say reflect on our job? As if you are not concerned. 
No, I think that the blame, no, say, the blame was to the entire parliament, not just the minority. Of course, but I said, you know, say, I'm not going to be a The expectation out there, they say, minority members, no, when you're part of the ruling party, no, and I'm uh, very vocal to speak against it, ain't it? Naturally, no, people would expect minority for, they say, I'm going to stand up. You make the point, say, I'm going to be a Have you done that through? The filing of urgent questions are 90. Theresa Awuni, the end of urgent question, and uh, a debate contribution. Urgent question. Oh, okay. The minister was brought before the uh, house to answer those questions. Honorable Suhini, question was an urgent question. This media review, the debate on it, the finance minister was there. Honorable Dongo said the plane before him, said he has caused this mess, he has benefited so much, and he should resign. He cannot lead this team to go and negotiate on behalf of the country before the IMF. So me Pacho, me Pacho, honorable, specifically yes, on uh, benefit and the company Enya from Bonta, uh, and I said, Sika, you raise you on the capital market, no? None the response to that here, then. Or by parliament, no? Uh, off head, we got more constituency. I don't have the hands right. Okay. But the hands right captured all the answers you provided. You got the question, no? Submitted question per by, you know? I hear presiding officer, and I'm saying, the second DPC speaker. They know a lot of certain supplementary questions. Oh, can I say, so who have any other issue? So I another question. The question was, how much have we spent on the transaction advising? That was the original question. Mm. Well, you can't go specific on him because our, our rules will not allow that. The supplementary question, you no, know, and about say, how much has his personal company benefiting? A whole conflict of interest is, you know, coming. It's you never, you know. And the speaker disallowed that question. But what you here? Yes. You know, he's there representing the ministry. And the company is a separate entity because, you know, in law, Unless you take off the corporate base to know the assets who are the shareholders who are behind those companies. Mm -hmm. So you can't just say that the black side land belongs to Dubai. So we are holding the Dubai to responsible. Unless you know those people who are behind that company, the shareholding structure and all that. It is the speaker that allowed that supplementary question. But we brought all this issue to the floor. And it was public knowledge. The media was there. It is a majority for the point of The minority has raised it temporarily. I have public knowledge. From the one. I can say all the bonds by 11 billion uh, dollar bond I'm raising, you know, they benefited so much from this. That's why they have the appetite for going to the international market to borrow. Because every transaction, you see uh, their cut. But one of my country was there, he separate from the company. Because the company has a great concern concept. Absolutely. You see, there are shareholders. There are people who are running the day-to-day the -day activities of the company. So having formed the company, and now it's a finance minister, he has resigned from that company. But we know that he set up the company. And majority of the workers, you know, and now no more check. I, 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 I remember about me and co. So me are no more data bank. I'm not too sure when you're not But who can come where I can say they've resigned from data bank and they are now working uh, with sex. There was a transaction over Kaya. We raised it and finally data bank withdrew from the transaction. That was last year. For the Kaidi issuer. Mm -hmm. We raised it and data bank issued a statement. You can just go. go. They issued a statement that uh, they are withdrawing from this. Uh, Transaction that they intended to partake. So, if somebody is telling us tomorrow, say, Parliament has left over its work or is not ready to see us, maybe the person has no pro the conversation. But the other, the other thing, and it's uh, uh, for concerns are Parliament erasing, you know, and I say members of Parliament be erasing. You know, what was the principle? Is the principle say? What be your finance minister and T and uh the company air transaction advisor for bond be a yeah bad? 
company a onu claim say wa resign from eh uh, eh bad and now say because the, the 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 argument was made say in times past all other bonds are here raise under previous government you know no? you would find data bank somewhere in there as a transaction advisor and also eh oh you say the, the time part I mean, a very critical in this conversation. The role the person is also playing is critical. Tony was a private person who engaged in the services, sir. We can't strike him for conflict of interest. But if you read the constitution, I think it's 296 or so. Why you have the power to exercise discretion power, no? mm -hmm. it should not be capricious, arbitrary, and all that. And when, when you're taking such a decision, I mean, the law is clear. When you have an interest in any matter, and the matter is brought before you, you need to declare your interest. And you should not take part in that decision making. Even as a member of parliament, when you serve on the board, and there's an issue uh, from the board before the house, and you are taking a decision, you must recruit yourself. That's why in law we say you can't be a judge in your own post. But that's what I say. If yes. you fail to declare your interest, and it is found out later on. So you have some interest. Uh, the law must be with you. This is the point that uh, the state institutions must wave into this matter. Yoko, special prosecutor, Shrek, and all that. Because my minority has raised this issue. You can, we cannot force the person to do any other thing. So the state institution must conduct their own investigation to find out the latency between the finance minister and that company. That time he was a private person. Today he has been given a responsibility as a finance minister. It will complain our certain app. Now complain and no one sata will call bond market to raise let's say two billion dollars. Now one will complain our certain app. I am part of the transaction advisory. What what so I resign or resign you? There's elements of conflict of interest. Because you have influence over the company. If you know hear it. And our bush and for a hey, shareholder of oh, that company. Now, find on the same state in which is one of them. It is a interesting issue of failure, sir. It's not uh, 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 for anybody to blame parliament or the minority on this matter. Because when you saw it, we raised it. It's like present while pointing what I say in the bush of another day. Minority raise the issues. But the same people say, sir, they qualify. They are Ghanaians, maybe one. It will be yes or not a more performance so abysmal. You can't bother to blame minority say yeah, we flew on. We will have raised the issue. What did the state actors also do to support the call from the minority? Yeah, but state actors need to be they would they would need to be petitioned before they act. It, for example, so offer Shraja and because they have a conflict of interest, they brought down corruption. And Shraj is that state ombudsman. You know, for the want of a better term, ah, mutimi is standing in the gap. A this uh, is there evidence say be a minority member be a petition charge on this? To the best of my knowledge, I don't have this information, but the point still remains to say, we are raising this issue on the floor several. The media was there; they captured it. And so, what did the media also do? Mm. But what else here? Yes. We had the fourth state of the realm. It is almost what is cutting in the subsequent days, you know. How did they deal with this matter? Because they have no money. Minority people have fished out the information. We've raised it. It has become part of our debate. The hazard has captured it. It has become public document. It is a certain switch to people on their own. Will not, uh, Initiate investigation to this matter, waiting for somebody's not an official complaint, so that they act upon it. Uh, what did the media also do? Mm. Okay. Because your, your uh, parliamentary press call, uh, all the media houses were read, but what I say? Yes. I said, public accounts committee, I invite state institutions. On the first is a court of after they are working on all those things that they could not respond adequately to it. You know, 
Attorney General set it up um, uh, in the initial prosecution. The two years of Attorney General who report to Nona to Antikia Kenya. Do you go back to blame Parliament? Meeting the whole set of institutions. I think that they are independent. To give them resources to do their work. Just yesterday, I read that uh, Bank of Ghana giving Chirac 10 million Ghana to the investigate a uh, banking I crisis. Amuma, Iyoko, uh, Iyoko, 10 million. Uh, sorry, Iyoko, 10 million Ghana to this. To do what? To facilitate the work they are doing in the war. Yes. To resolve them so that they will be in a better position to work. They will not come to government so that the finance minister will deny them resources to work. But we know Bank of Ghana is independent, though the structures and then the appointing uh, authority is there and all that. But having received this money from Bank of Ghana, it is presumed that they will do an independent investigation to the matter. It is a way in a course of near your amount for reason to say about 2025 billion Ghana cities. What you could have spent, let's say, 9 billion to sell all this financial inclusion. The Bank of Ghana now is here in CPA, it's number 10 million Ghana cities to do this work for him or for ATA. It has to say, they black all these issues raised by other individuals. That's why they want to get to the bottom of this matter. So, parliament or minority have raised these issues that very, if mentioned names, if you invited the finance minister to the floor to answer questions relating to this transaction. So, we are expecting the state institutions to act upon this information provided by the minority. They can't sit in their comfort zone and expect minorities to come and lodge an official complaint before they ask. It, it depends on the state institution in question because a a, a shraja, they will need a petition before before they act as a twenty. It depends. But the state prosecutor is there. Yoko is there. Well, they have financial. I uh, uh, what they call forensic and financial intelligence. Yeah. Uh, uh, a body and as a branch mm -hmm. in Yoko, which deals with all this matter. It is a very really conflict of interest matter. Put the constitution is very clear on it, and many of our laws are very clear on it. I remember for parliament, that's why I said we are a member of parliament. Now, person who undertake any business opener, you appear before a committee for certification before you can do any other business. When the issue uh, is brought before your committee, first you declare your interest. Yeah. When there's a voting, you don't take part in the voting. So our rules are very clear. Who are the implementers of the laws? We pass the law, and we have an agency whose responsibility it is to implement the laws. Honorable, ma ma ya nasi bibiani ya yebesi ya dinkomobio why? Yeah, that's the power. He's the Honorable Member of Parliament for Bia East Constituency, Richard Achampon, a member of the Finance Committee.